So today I got to the studio and recorded the first almost four chapters of my book. It was probably the coolest thing I think I've ever done in my life. It was, um, it was so fun. It was the coolest thing. It was reading my, my own work, my own words, in my own voice. Like the way I wanted and want my readers to hear the story. The way I really felt about it while I was either living it or writing it. So I was able to say it the way that I wanted. The, so when you download it and you listen to it, you're going to hear it through me, like actually me. And I think that's the coolest thing ever where I was able to kind of like, you know, say say things the way that I wanted to. I was able to do my um, my best, what I'm calling douchebag voice. I mean, what else am I going to say? Um, and there were a few times where I was like, was that, was that mean enough, you know, um, to my guy that was helping me with it. But um, it was it was fun. We had a good time recording. We laughed. Um, I cried. Of course, I'm a massive crier. Um, but it was it was so fun. It was something I, I never thought I would be able to do anything like this in my entire life. I never really expected to have much of a life at all. And now here I am, like, you know, traveling and reading and writing and getting published and, you know, have everything I really ever wanted. I think it's um, just amazing how far I have come in this crazy life. And I, I cried while I was reading today because I thought about my dad. I wrote in the book a little bit about my dad. I cried some of the parts about Derek because it's, you know, father of my kids and I did him dirty, you know, and that was really hard. To read, to like read again, and I'm dreading chapter seven. So if anyone out there has read my book yet, then they know what chapter seven is, and they know why I'm dreading it. But it was, um, it was amazing. It was fun. It was freeing. It was the coolest thing I think I've ever done in my entire life. And you know, I was excited to come home and record this video. Sad part about it is because I don't have a person. I don't have like a person that I can call and say, oh my gosh, guess what? Or, you know, someone who's going to check in and be like, how did that go? And, you know, ask me about it. And I feel like I'm able to do these videos because it's um, like I'm talking to someone that cares in that way. And I'm sure that there is someone out there that does care in that way. I'm sure there's someone out there who wants more than just to sleep with me, which seems to be um, the thing lately, and I don't understand what that is. But, um, I mean, obviously I understand what it is, but it doesn't mean that's what I want. I'm definitely more than just that. So I had an amazing time and thought it was just the, the most fun, the coolest thing I've ever done. And my acting seemed to be pretty good. My little narrative voice seemed to be pretty good. I listened to a playback, and I was like, oh, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. So it was amazing. It was it was such a cool thing, and I had so much fun with it. So next week I'll be in recording my podcast. The week after that I'll be recording for another few hours of my book. Hopefully it'll be done fairly soon. Then we'll edit, and then we'll get it released so people can start listening to it. But as they edit, they're going to send me the chapters so I can listen to them and see how they sound. If there were anything like I heard today, I'm I'm really excited about this. I think this will be such a such a great thing, and I'm so happy that it's my voice, that it's my passion coming through, that it's my my twist on it, my everything. Because those are my words. Those are my words, and it's my story. And I think the best person to read that would be me. I was a little nervous about my accent, but pfft, it is what it is, man. Like this is who I am. You know, like it or hate it, it doesn't matter. It's not going to change. So I had to have it in my accent, in my voice. And the guy that I was working with was like, oh, it's pretty good. You know, he thought it was, he thought it was, I was doing pretty well with it. So I was happy to hear that. And he liked the story, which was great. He was a little interested in the story. So I think that's pretty cool too. But 
Um, so yeah, overall great day, great experience, great fun, coolest thing I think I've ever done in my whole life. And I'm really eager to get it done and excited for the rest of the world to hear it in my voice um, and to learn from it. So, I don't know. Pretty excited about it. Can't wait for it to be finished. <laughs>